In today's fast-paced society, social media has become the best way to spread the news throughout a community and the world. Monitor's Damon Jones takes a look at one person using that outlet for agriculture. Despite being a full-time nurse and a full-time mother, Ashley Wood does find a little bit of time for her other passion, blogging, as her Across the Branch entries give readers a look into daily farming life while also providing her a chance to learn new things every day. Well, I do a lot of uh, ag education on my blog. I talk about cotton and watermelons, which are the two things that we grow. Uh, I started, I didn't know anything about farming when I came here four years ago. And I just think it's neat. I, I enjoy learning about farming, and I still enjoy learning about farming. And Brad and I were just talking about something this morning that I didn't know, and I enjoyed learning about that, and then I like to share it with others. And I think it's important that people who aren't familiar with agriculture know about agriculture. It's an interest her husband Brad fully encourages as he's more than willing to share his farming knowledge. I think he enjoys teaching me. I'm a question asker. I ask him tons of questions and and he'll take the time to show me what I'm asking and, and I think he enjoys teaching too and he's still learning. He talks to me about learning things and he'll share that with me and you know, you're always learning something. And that learning doesn't stop in the fields, as this project has also shown Ashley just how many people social media actually reaches. I, I find it very interesting on Twitter, especially using the hashtags with farm and Georgia and, and different, to bring different communities together. And, and I really wasn't aware of the, the broad range or the broad audience that you can reach with doing something like that. Combine that with the ease of use and social media could be the future I, when it comes I'm to spreading ready. agricultural information. I think there's great potential. I think that we've seen we've seen such historical things happen via social media just in the last several months in our world and and I think that there's nothing that is keeping agriculture from from doing something like that, informing people and, and getting people involved. It also gives farmers a chance to have their side of the story heard, which can be very important in this technological age. Well, if we don't tell our story, somebody else will, and it may not be what, what is really true or right. And so we need to tell our story about how we do things and, and what we do and um, so that it's our voice that people hear. For the Georgia Farm Monitor, I'm Damon Jones.